Welcome back, people of Tamriel. I'm Xenocraft1212, back with another Skyrim mod showcase video. It's my character, Sauron, and this is called Master of the Eagles by GG77. And to start this not quest, but to start this mod, we must go to Farangar Secret Fire and buy the Conjure Eagle spellbook. Now, Until next a lot of other GT77 mods begin in the exact same way. Just find Farangar and buy books from him. Now we know Conjure Eagle. Now, we basically go full on Gandalf here and ride a giant eagle. Or at least that's how I understand it. Magic. Be under conjuration, I think. Yep, there we go, eagle. And is both handed. I do not know if you can do this in a city, actually, so this may or may not be interesting. I don't know if they. Oh, they do come at you from the sky. Oh, that's awesome. I approve. Okay, the script worked. And we are now almost riding an eagle. We are attempting to ride an eagle and failing. Oh, the lag, though. Oh, 10 frames. Game does not like eagle. Not at all. Okay, don't try and ride an eagle in Whiterun. The game doesn't like it in the slightest. Oh, he's still alive. Nice. Well, that worked. Anyways, there's Gomachan. He can fuse for Dawa. I've done a separate video on him. Let's try this outside riddle actually work, shall we? Now, this eagle should be completely controllable. But I don't think he fight. Really has to be raining right now. Really game. Really. I don't think he can fight, but you can control where he flies. And plus custom audio and custom scripts for the automatic flying. <laughs> but we will not be flying in the rain. No, no. Come here, friend. Maybe. Maybe. Dragon has returned. Okay, and now let's try. I do not know where my friend Falakar went. He's just gone. Falakar is a dragon follower at the same time. Mounting dragon. Your dragon is ready for takeoff. Well, my dragon doesn't look like a dragon. So I have the camera zoomed out all the way, but as you can see, we are controlling where this thing goes, like, we're actually riding it, like, this is our steed. A giant eagle is our steed. And I think that's just really cool. Like, we are Gandalf. We've basically become one with the Gandalf. Although, like, when you are flying in the air like this, you get to realize that Skyrim doesn't load in very much. There's a very small portion around you that's actually loaded in. When I fly closer to the ground, only this much of the game is loaded around you. Which looks fine when you're on the ground, but when you're in the air, it doesn't look as good. <laughs> that's weird. So apparently it makes tons of noise. But this way you can get around very quickly, you know, you could totally get rid of fast traveling if, if you wanted to, and then this would make that much easier, much faster, and just, it looks amazing. It's just really cool, in my opinion. But like I said, he cannot fight, he's strictly for transportation purposes, but still really cool. And just press A to land if you're using a controller. Press A again to get off. I'm not sure what the keyboard controls are. And then he just flies away. With better animations than, than when you were flying on him. 
And yes, the game does count the eagles as dragons, but they do have their own separate audio and their own scripts. And yeah, that's pretty much it. I think that that's pretty cool. You probably won't see it because I'm trying to like get rid of extra mods and improve my frames and whatnot, but well, and stability of the game in general. But I think that that's really cool, and I would definitely use it if I were to try and run without fast traveling at all, because then it would be a way to lessen the annoyance of not fast traveling, while at the same time you don't just get to instantly teleport. And, you know, you can release, like, I think it'd be funny if you had to release, like, a butterfly or moth every time you wanted to fly on the eagle, like Gandalf. So, th that could be really cool for, like, if you're doing a roleplay, you know, like, having a Nord character with a big beard and have him be Gandalf and then have this mod and, like, have a rule set amongst yourselves that in order to have an eagle show up, you have to, like, release a butterfly. I don't know, I just think it sounds like a cool idea. Even though I can't catch butterflies alive, but, you know, just drop their wings or whatever. And, I don't know, just the possibilities with simple mods like this are endless in my opinion. But anyways, if you stayed this long, then you should subscribe, because I do lots of mod showcase videos, and there's another one coming in the near future that adds basically the same concept as the eagle, except with dragons, and there's like... 30 different kinds of dragons. Won't be showing them all, but if you like this, there's more coming, and also by GG77. But until next time, goodbye.